Hi, welcome to Great Gadgets and Gear. I wanted to share with you this wool blanket I picked up off of Amazon. It's by the Woolly Mammoth Company. And I found it to be quite a find. They're middle of the road expensive wise. Um, this is from their farmhouse collection. It's 80 bucks. Sometimes you can get a little cheaper. Uh, sometimes they even give like different prices for different colors. So you just gotta kind of watch it. Um, they do have seven colors. This is tan and cream. They have black and cream, gray and yellow, navy and cream, red, black and cream, red, navy and cream, and teal and cream. Apparently cream's a hot color in the farmhouse. It's a throw blanket size, a good size though. It's 66 by 90 and it weighs four pounds so it's got some heft to it. It's 80 percent virgin merino wool. And it's got some acrylic added to the warp and the well. It's woven using a twill weave, so it's full of loft and softness. It's got a brushed finish, and it's got some really nice edging. It's double stitched. So let's take a look at it. Open it up here. Okay. So the first thing you'll see is you get this nice little card from the company. And they explain a little bit about it. And then on the back, which is really nice, I don't know if that's going to focus or not, but you get a fiber composition, care instructions, cleaning instructions, removing odors, removing pills, which are the little balls you get on there, and then a little note about fire retardant, um, that these are not fireproof, and it's not fire retardant. Uh, a lot of wools are, this one isn't. Um, do not wash this thing, this is dry clean only. Um, and I noticed too that I purchased a, an ex inexpensive wool blanket off Amazon for like 30 bucks, one of those green ones with the little army stamp on them. Um, I don't think it's army issue, especially at that price. But uh, it was this one you could throw in the washer, and I hated it. It was itchy. Uh, first time I washed it, it had those little pills or the little balls all over it. I mean, just, you'd have to, there's no shaving that thing. It was just covered in them. Uh, so, uh, you know, I tend to think, too, that the dry clean only ones hold up a little bit better. Just my opinion. So, like I said, this is the farmhouse collection. They also have the Explorer collection, which is nice. It's about 20 bucks cheaper at 60 bucks, And that one does ship out Prime. This one doesn't. This one comes right from the company. The Explorer collection has solid colors. They don't have the same color options as this one. Uh, they come in gray, navy, olive green, and tan. But they're the same throw size of 66 by 90. They weigh the same four pounds, and they're promoting them for camping, cabin use, outside picnics, stuff like that. They're a milled finish, so they're a denser blanket, so they're not quite as thick and lofty as this one is. Um, but it's nice that you have a couple of choices there. The only thing I really didn't like was you couldn't get this in like a queen size or a king size. This seems to be the their optimal size that they make. Um, really like it though. I've been using it on the couch. I haven't had it for very long. Um, but man, it was really warm. I was actually kicking it off. I mean, it, it feels and looks really, really thin, but it's just, it's so soft. It's so warm. And at the size that it is with the 66 by 90, you can even double it over if you're really, really cold. Um, the color options I like with this, you know, if you have company and stuff, they're fashionable, they're warm, you know, they're not itchy wool. Uh, really, really, really liking it, really enjoying it. So I actually picked up another one. So this is the gray and yellow one uh, to have some, some different colors. This is the one actually I've been using on the couch. And uh, it's just, it's great. It's not scratching, itching my face or anything. And I, first, I think it's a steal of a deal for 80 bucks for what you get. Um, you can get alpaca, you can get 100% wool, you know, but you're gonna, and you can get queen and king. And you're going to be looking at over 200 bucks you know, to start for, for a decent wool blanket. These are pretty nice for, for their size. Um, so I'm quite happy with them. So I just wanted to share this with you. Um, go check out the Woolly Mammoth Company. They explain in great de detail on their website how they make these uh, blankets, how they're put together and everything. It's really cool. The company is very open, you know, about, you know, what they use and how they make them and stuff. It's really informative. Um, so, if you have any questions or comments, drop them down in the section. I'll answer what I can. Thanks for watching the video. Wooly Mammoth on Amazon.
Take care to the next video.